John Roselle was an all-Southwest Florida performer at Estero High School. This four-year letterman was a two-time all-conference standout, hitting 450 during his senior campaign. While looking at colleges, the son of Linda and the late John Roselle finally remember family vacations traveling to East Tennessee many times while growing up. When recruited by the MC coaching staff, he said it felt like a family atmosphere, and he loved the location to continue his athletic and academic endeavors. The spring of 1992 saw the careers of Wall of Fame standouts Clint Bowling, Scotty Klein, and Glenn Cullop wrapping up. The Scots baseball staff of Brian Wadgert and Eric Etchison knew they had to hit a home run to keep the newly developed program success moving in the right direction. Early in the season, this 5'10 speedy outfielder crashed into the on-field bullpens and broke his wrist, causing major concern. He helped the team as a pitch runner until the cast was removed. Roselle ended the season an amazing 27 for 29 leading the Scots in stolen bases. Once the cast was removed, he hit the ground running. His play in center field helped Maribel to a 24-14 record, a 22-10 mark against D3 opponents. John finished his inaugural collegiate campaign hitting 345, fifth on the team, while scoring 32 runs that ranked him second on the talented squad. He was also a clutch performer, racking up 29 RBIs, the fourth most on the team. In 1993, Coach Etchison took over the program with a strong foundation up the middle that included senior shortstop Mike Averill, and senior second baseman Thyre Rhodes, along with sophomore center fielder John Roselle. Roselle played in all 30 games, going 11 for 16 in stolen bases while hitting 330 on the season. He was consistently on base with a 410 on base percentage, allowing teammates Mark Curtis and Thyre Rhodes key RBI opportunities that they took advantage of. At the conclusion of only two seasons in, in the Orange and Garnet, Roselle had already eclipsed the career stolen base mark at MC with 38 thefts. The spring of 1994, John's junior season brought a great deal of excitement to the baseball program. With the community help of Anderson Lumber Company, MC Scotland Yard received a facelift with perimeter bleachers, a new perimeter fence, lights, and a new scoreboard. In 30 games, Roselle paced the Scots with his 351 batting average. He led Maribel in at-bats with 94, 33 hits, 3 home runs, and 27 RBIs, while going a perfect 9 for 9 in stolen bases. Roselle's role changed a great deal, hitting many times in the third and fourth spots, relying on the seasoned vet to drive in Chucky Yates, Jeff Rosa, Ryan Rogers, and Andy Moss, all outstanding offensive weapons within the system. At season's end, John Roselle was named the most valuable player and maintained his efforts off the field, earning Dean's List honors in the classroom. John Roselle's senior season in the spring of 1995 was one for the record books. He led the Scots to a new school record for team wins, going 28-10 on the season. The record stood for 21 years until Coach Cody Church's squad went 29-15 in 2016. In 1986, Coach Edison as a player established a single-season hit mark of 47. Roselle simply shattered that mark nine years later with 64 hits, establishing a new school annual mark that still ranks fourth today. John led Maribel with an amazing 460 batting average, pacing MC in doubles with 15, triples with 7, and RBIs with 43. He finished 30 for 34 in stolen bases and struck out only four times in over 150 plate appearances. His seven triples in a season is still an MC baseball annual record. To put his season in perspective, his 460 average was ranked 15th nationally within the NCAA Division III. He ranked 17th in toughest to strike out, 19th in stolen bases, and 22nd in triple. He was one of the first MC baseball players in Coach Edison's tenure to earn ABCA All-South Region honors, and at the end of the academic year, he was awarded the prestigious MC J.D. Davis Award for his stellar career on and off the diamond. John Roselle helped Maryville College to an 82-54 career record, winning 60% of all challenges. In 131 career games, he tallied 396 at-bats, scoring 101 runs on 148 career hits for an amazing 374 career batting average with 114 RBIs. On the base pass, he finished 77 for 88 in stolen bases. 
He utilizes speed, roaming Scotland Yards, large outfield with 239 putouts and 13 career assists. Upon graduation, John worked for the Lee County School District in Fort Myers, Florida. He was a business teacher while coaching baseball and football. He is presently the assistant principal for administration at Riverdale High School in Fort Myers. He has been married for the past 13 years to Tiffany and they are the proud parents of Lacey and Wyatt. Ladies and gentlemen, please help me congratulate John Roselle. His efforts set the foundation for the Scots baseball program to record eight 20 plus win seasons over the next 10 campaigns. To one of the best complete student athletes to ever come out of the Scots baseball program, John Roselle, welcome to the Maryville College Wall of Fame.